Veriflex is a heat softening acrylic available at Great Lakes Orthodontics. It is often recommended for individuals possessing moderate dental undercuts where standard acrylic would be too retentive. When warmed with tap water, this hard acrylic softens, allowing it to have greater flexibility, providing a snap fit with easy appliance removal. Common Veriflex appliances include a variety of clusal splints and snoring or sleep apnea devices such as Herbst, Napa, and Clearway appliances. Please note that all sleep appliances for commercial sale must be registered with the FDA. Veriflex is available at Great Lakes Orthodontics in one half pound starter and one pound economy kits. Individual components are available in one pound and five pound polymer containers, as well as eight ounce and one quart monomer bottles. It is necessary to store the Veriflex monomer within a refrigerator designated for chemical use only. This will slow the set speed of the resin when mixed, making it easier to handle. The Veriflex acrylic may be processed using the hand adapted method or flasking process. The flasking process involves creation of a waxed appliance, investment, wax removal of appliance, and packing with Veriflex acrylic. For best results, the hand adapted method is suggested. Here, the polymer powder and monomer liquid is measured. Depending on the amount of acrylic to be applied, usually 20 to 30 milliliters of polymer should be mixed with 15 to 25 milliliters of monomer. With Veriflex, more monomer is needed rather than the common 2 to 1 volume ratio of powder to liquid that is used with standard acrylics. A higher level of monomer is needed to absorb polymer beads resulting in clearer appliance. Models are soaked in cool tap water for 20 minutes. This is needed to push out air from within as later models will be submerged in pressure pot water to cure acrylic. Excessive air in model could affect quality of acrylic cure and adaptation. Remove models from water and evict surface moisture with air gun. A Great Lakes fume controller is suggested to contain strong vapors from acrylics. Also, acrylic resin waste should be discarded in a garbage can with lid to limit vapors. Apply Great Lakes liquid separator to model in all areas acrylic will contact with a 3 quarter inch tip brush. Select the ratio of acrylic resin needed to fabricate appliance and measure monomer and polymer and polypropylene medicine cup. To mix the two components a large resin mix cup and wax spatula is used. Also a non-spill monomer bottle can aid in dispensing monomer into measuring cup. Once monomer level is measured, pour liquid into large resimix cup. Then measure polymer into medicine cup. Pour polymer powder into monomer liquid while spatulating in resimix cup. Once resin is mixed, place mixing cup on medium set vibrator to evict air from mix for about 10 seconds. If wires are to be integrated within acrylic, apply a small amount of flowable resin with spatula. This is done immediately after the vibration process. With a paper towel, clean spatula and remove crystallized resin mix from along inner wall of mixing cup with spatula. This will prevent cloudy patches within resin. Apply Vaseline to gloves. Check state of resin mix. Resin should polymerize to manageable dough-like consistency. A secondary large resin mix cup is used to hold Veriflex monomer. This will be used to shape acrylic resin. Remove dough-like resin from mixing cup. Place resin in palm of hand and shape to cigar-like form. Then place material on a clusal of model and hand adapt using the side cup of Veriflex monomer. Excess material may be cut off if desired before placing into pressure pot to cure. If an occlusal registration is needed, assemble articulator and close to bite position. A heated Great Lakes pressure pot is used. The model or models with formed resin is submerged in water within pressure pot. Water temperature is about 125 to 130 degrees Fahrenheit. The preset pressure used is 20 PSI. Cure time is one hour. Once cured, remove pressure from pot and open lid. Remove models and cured acrylic. 
A water bath or hot water pot is used to soften plastic on models. Water temperature is about 160 degrees Fahrenheit. Place model with acrylic in water for about 10 to 15 seconds. This should soften plastic to make easy removal. With a lab knife, remove acrylic from model. To trim Veriflex acrylic, standard burrs and grinding wheels on lathe or handpiece may be used. Veriflex is finished with pumice and plastic center rag wheel, as well as polished with Tripoli and Fabuluster applied to 4-inch loose muslin buff wheels.